are moving to update number two. Yes, this week or today's couple uh, diary session. I think that the next update on our list is Jason and then Dali. You know, this week they are the head of us. And as part of their new regulation, you know, you hear new king, new law. Jason and darling are going to do something what are they going to do subscribe to this channel like share and then put us on post notifications so that whenever we post you get to see what we are doing on this platform the two of them said initially when they were the head of house they were a bit lenient and all that so people uh, took them for granted and sometimes they didn't respect and then obey the the instructions they give but this time around they are going to do something what are they going to do watch this video we'll be back Hi, Big Mama. Congratulations. Thank you very much, Big Mama. On your age -wage. Oh, <laughs> thank you very much, Big Mama. Second time? Second. Would you want to go for a third? Yes. <laughs> we want to maintain the room permanently. Hey. <laughs> I think I have a fair idea why oh. we want to maintain the room. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Can you please share? Nah, forget. Forget mm. about me. Okay. How are you both doing? We are doing um, great. But come to think of the HOH thing, you guys didn't really seem excited. <laughs> Until um, um, Tessie spoke about it, she was like, it's okay now. I think people are abiding nowadays. So your so. challenge was for the fact that you thought people were still yeah, not stone cold? Yes. Use that word. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's say the last time you were HOH, there were some mistakes you might have made along the way. Um, I don't know the mistakes, though, but I want to believe there are some things you would have done differently. Yeah. So what are you doing differently now just to make this time zone look good? Okay, I think I was um, lenient on, on some people because I thought they were, they were older. So I think I have to be strict on every, everybody. Not necessarily strict, but then um, I should make everyone abide by all the rules. Darlene, what's your view? Um, same as he said. Please, you can have a mind of your own. You can't say same as he said, no, no, no. I won't work for that. So, uh, what's your mind? Okay, so, it was actually my first time, so I wanted everybody to have his or her freedom, but it was like we were too lenient on them, so they wanted to disrespect us in some ways and not abide by what we tell them. So this time around, we are going to not be strict, though, but we'll let them abide by it. Yeah. So, pardon my language. For lack of better words, you're going to be can't we? Exactly. <laughs> Darling, is that what you're going to be? Maybe. You think it will work? You mm. just have to say whatever it is you need to say to somebody with love, and then I'm sure it will get done. Oh, true. Unless it's not coming from a very good place. Yeah. Do you agree? Yes. Okay. So, talking about bed issue. Hmm? Did you give your bed out this time? This time around, I was like, no one should sleep on it until I come back. So, what if you don't come back? Are you are still, you win the HOH uh, next week, <laughs> and you win it next, you know, the following week. Nobody should still sleep on your bed. Exactly. Hey, JC. Hmm. That's what she said. This bed thing. Darlene, did you also do that? I didn't do that, but he just made me aware. He made an announcement. Nobody so someone should. can use your bed? Um, but they should understand that when I come back, there shouldn't be any misunderstanding. Just pack over and then we use the bed. Bed issues. I mean, obviously, talking to you both yesterday, everybody can actually tell there's some growth between the two of you, right? We, yeah, we, yesterday. Yeah, talking to both. I mean, I spoke to you, I spoke to her. Yeah. Yeah, independently. Yeah. yeah. Individually now, what do you think caused the, you know, what, what would be the reason for that growth? Is there something you can pinpoint? Um, for me, I think it was a commitment communication we I voice out a lot if there's something bothering me I always try and tell her darling but here's the case I used to not listen but I think I listen to him more nowadays so, so one is listening one is caring enough and 
So we're getting somewhere, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, moving forward, Jason. Yes, Big Mama. The word L O V E. How do you pronounce that? Love. Do you think people are misusing the word? A lot. <laughs> A lot. Yes, Big Why Mama. Why is that? I think they use the word um, most times, but then they don't act towards it. Are you saying people use the word, but they don't mean saying it? Sometimes. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, sometimes. How many times have you used the word love to Darlene, if you had counted? Uh, <laughs> I would say quite a number of times. Did you mm. meet every one of them? No. <laughs> from, um, from the start, no, but then um, later on, I... I felt it. I actually felt it. So I. Yeah. You, were, so you, you were also misusing the word, just as others were misusing the word. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> yes. But now you mean it. Yeah. Darlene, Big he mama. means it now. So talk to me about him meaning it. Darlene, Big Mama. Should I tell Jason about your request yesterday? Hey. I thought you told him already. No, I didn't. Oh. Did I catch you off guard? Yes. <laughs> okay, so should I tell him now? Yes, please. Jason. Yes, big mama. I am speaking on behalf of Darlene. Yes, big mama. Our message is very clear and simple. <laughs> we want you to be clingy. That is the word. More clingy. We want you to spice things up. We want you to talk more. I mean, not forgetting to everybody, but to her to talk more to her in a very caring manner. Darlene, am I getting it right? Yes, please. Okay, so spice things up. I don't know how you spice things up, but there's so many things in the house you can use to spice things up. Jason, yes, we mama. think outside the box. Let me make our girl happy. Oh, I got you. Darlene, the <laughs> dad is a cute as well. Yes, big mama. You owe me, Darlene. Is there any other thing you'd like me to know? Both of you? For me, I'm good. Why would you be? Darlene? <laughs> I think I'm also fine. Why would you be? I just executed your work for you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, Big Mama. You, Have big a mama. good day. You too, Big Mama. <laughs> That's Jalen for you. Jason and then uh, Darlene uh, talking about the things they will be doing as new H-O-H. And initially, they said they were not really happy about being ahead of us because of the problems, you know, they encountered in the affairs. But they said after having a conversation with Tessie, uh, they now, you know, embrace their new title as head of us for the second time. I think we are in week what? Week seven? Yes. So being head of us uh, twice, I think that they like it. But they told Big Mama that Charlie, this time around, no mess, no mess for anybody. They are going to be extra strict extra strict because they realized that in the first one they thought people were oh they could take decisions and be responsible in their dealings and all that but it didn't go as planned and people didn't really obey them take their instructions and all that so this time around they are not going to you know be lenient with anybody they are going to uh, uh, you know execute the rules and enforce the regulations in the house with full force and power no mercy for the cripple or no mercy for anybody in the big mama house. So housemates should be ready because Jason and Darlene are coming. And, you know, they also spoke about uh, their relationship so far. And I think that these two, yes, I, I also like what they are building in the house. And at the end of the day, as far as everybody is finding love, I think initially then Jason the misbehave. Initially then Jason the misbehave. Why? But after the whole apology did nothing, after the whole apology did nothing, I think that Jason is uh, coming around uh, small, small, and now they are in a very good space, and I think that this relationship is going to work, it's going to be good, it's going to be sweet. So, let's see how the two of them will reign as the new HOH after Tessie and Martin. Long may they reign. If you watch uh, Game of Thrones, they say, long may he reign, long may she reign. Yes, yeah, so let's see how the rain will be till next monday this is loyalty tv studio subscribe like share and then put us on post notification this is the only place where pm extra will give it to you back to back to back every day
minimum five updates is what we provide on our channel kindly subscribe like share and then put us on post notification we out